day three of the Rolex Fastnet race, and the light winds have made conditions challenging and progress slow. With the focus now on the southern tip of Ireland's rugged landscape, there's been a sense of anticipation for the arrival of the first monohulls to reach the Fastnet rock off Baltimore. In the early hours of Tuesday morning, it was Jim Clark's Comanche who rounded the rock first. The American Maxi had been trailing compatriot and adversary Rambler, but passed her overnight to lead the quest for monohull line honours. Rambler crawled round the rock some three hours later, behind Comanche, but ahead of Mike Slade's Leopard, the third favourite for line honours. They too have been struggling in the very light winds and ghosted past the rock at a frustrating two knots. But perhaps the biggest surprise has been the impressive performance by Momo, the newly launched Maxi 72. Despite giving away almost 30 feet in length to Leopard, she has hung onto her coattails and holds a tentative overall lead in the race on IRC Handicap. But with testing wind conditions predicted to continue, this 2015 edition of the Rolex Fastnet race is far from over. The first of the multi-hulls are expected to arrive in Plymouth in the early hours of Wednesday morning, with the leading monohulls a little later on at dawn. Stay tuned for more race updates.